Here comes Chris Duclair turning back in the left wing corner. Duclair stopping up there on the left side, making moves, cuts to the goal line, back behind the net. Duclair in the right circle, feeds it across, left wing, scores! Alexi Van Hoop-Cachero in the left face-off circle took the pass from Duclair on the right side and buried it past the blocker side of Jordan Fairley. And two minutes and eight seconds into this hockey game, it's Van Hoop-Cachero that has given West Kelowna a one to nothing lead. Fifth goal of the season for Alexi Van Hoop-Cachero. Walks out left circle, moving to the top of the dot, right wing there, Harrington, a shot stopped by Katz, the rebound, they score! It's Austin Fraser once again, he had two last night, and he's tied the game with 14.44 to go in this opening period. Fraser standing in front of the shot that came from Harrington on the right side, his first attempt was denied, and the rebound in front, a couple of whacks at it by a Spruce King of the side of the goal, McGregor Bennett. Below the goal line, trying to find the handle on this as everybody coming together here on the end boards. Cameron trying to find it as well. May back below the goal line behind the net, trying to dig this free. Everybody just holding this puck up. Bobby May doing a terrific job of keeping that puck held up behind the goal, but it's gathered up and put to the front of the net. Chipped on scores. Luke Schneider in front of the goal after a good battle behind the net. The Spruce King got the puck. Jack Stockfish came out in front and put a shot on. Justin Katz made the save, but it's Schneider at the side of the goal who banks it in. And Luke Schneider has, or Jake Schneider, I should say, has his eighth goal of the season, and it's 2-1 Prince George. Down low. Urig with it there as he ties his man up at the end boards and Reeves comes along now and played ahead on the right side by the defender and the affiliate player in Schottmeyer and back into the Warriors. Here's Sharoon, left circle shot, scores! Riley Sharoon from the left wing circle fires a shot up and over the glove side of Jordan Fairley. Sharoon's got his second goal of the season and the Warriors are able to tie this game up. It's two to two. from Prince George, and we're underway here in period number two. The Warriors going from right to left on your computer screens and radio dot, or, and the uh, computer screens here uh, tonight. The Spruce Kings going uh, left to right here in this second period. There's a chance, right side scores! Aiden Reeves, the Prince George kid, finds the back of the net on the shot from the right circle. His second goal of the season, and just 15 seconds into the second frame, it's 3-2 West Kelowna. To the right point, Kai Greaves fires it back down below the goal line behind the net now. Collected up there by Schneider, he tried to sling a pass back in front and the Warriors will turn it the other way. Here's Karanik, across the line, drop pass, Moriel, a left circle, just missed on a low shot and wide to the glove side. Prince George will take it the other way. Here's Schneider, right wing to the net, scores! Jake Schneider from the top of the right circle throws one on and eludes Justin Katz and goes off his glove into the back of the net. Schneider's got the marker, his second of the game, his ninth of the year, and it's 3-3. over five minutes gone in the second period and Jake Schneider's second goal the game to the blue line for Norland. Norland walking in right point, sends it left side, Moriello to the net, that's blocked as well and it comes off of McGregor Bennett right to the net, scores! Luke Devlin right in front on the deflection as he deflects in the Isaiah Norland shot and the Warriors up ahead four to three on the power play goal by Luke Devlin.
That was a fortunate bounce for the Warriors with that puck coming off of a body of McGregor Bennett as he came out of the penalty box. Prince George trying to clear, and Norland just put it to the net. Devlin deflects it in. The left side through his legs, driving wide, cuts to the net, just lost the handle as he tried to make his way in front and just lost the handle on his backhand. Fired down ice by Evan Fidel. Warriors turn the puck over. Here's Fidel in the slot. Oh, what a stop by Justin Katz. Oh, my goodness, what a save. Katz gave the puck away but recovered and made a phenomenal blocker stop on Evan Fidel to keep the game in the Warriors' favor. What a stop that was. Try to get that back down low. Up the wall, Bernadette will hold it on side, walking down the right side, in front for Sharoon. Nice pass, left wing. Oh, what a stop by Fairley. He robbed Kyla Green from the left face-off circle on a terrifically set-up play by Riley Sharoon. Puck back at center. Greaves fires it in off the inboards. Five seconds to go in the third. Here's May in the left wing side. Put it out to center. That puck will go to neutral ice, and that'll be it. The buzzer sounds. The Warriors win the hockey game 4-3 the final score West Kelowna can go home happy as they are able to take the second game of this two game weekend set here in Prince George and the Warriors come away victorious here tonight 4-3 the final score from the Kopar Memorial Arena here in Prince George Luke Devlin the game winning goal on the power play in the third period